think about why the capacity for preferences matters morally, even when a patient doesn't reason well, we can think about two key values. The first is liberty. Uh, you know, individuals basically have a normative claim to uh, exercising their free will. Uh, and outside of the hospital, we let people do this all the time, even when their reasons don't make sense, and even when the consequences are bad. Uh, inside the hospital, however, we, we heavily prioritize their ability to think rationally. Secondly, people who don't think well are nonetheless persons, and persons are deserving of respect. So again, even when someone isn't reasoning well, their mere claim to be respected as a person, combined with the fact that they're expressing a preference, entitles them to some moral weight in the decision-making process about their own care. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.